Hey guys, it's Mark from North of Seven Outdoors. Welcome back to another episode. Today we are doing our Black Friday uh, order from Tackle Warehouse. If you're lucky enough to be on their VIP list, then you get to start their Black Friday purchases early. So, um, here we are. It ends, uh, ends Tuesday, so that's next Tuesday. Uh, if you're not on the order, then I think it starts Thursday. So, let's uh, knock it out. And I thought, you know what? Might as well share this with uh, people, my thought process here. Um, so these are the brands that you get 30% off of. So not quite their staples that they normally have. Uh, so Power Bait, uh, that's pretty cool because that includes Maxent. Um, Gamakatsu, I'm not like huge into Gamakatsu. I'll buy it uh, here and there. It's, there's nothing wrong with it. Uh, Gamma, I don't. I'm tempted to buy six pound Gamma. Uh, fluorocarbon, G Crack, Guggen Squad. Nichols Lures, Missile, uh, Mustad, Z-Man, X-Zone, Yozuri. They're pretty standard. Uh, I miss Gambler and AccuCall because I wanted to buy some AccuCall stuff this year. And this is basically a 30% off brand. I'm not going to go hog wild like I normally do. Um, I'm going to get what I need and a few fun things to try around. But during the 25 days of Christmas, I, I'll probably will go hog wild on it. So uh, let's get started here. Uh, let's go with ARC because I've already kind of done a little bit of research here. Uh, let's get past all these walls, rods, reels. What else we got here? All right. I believe it's this one. So I believe that these are already on clearance. 357 So they're almost a dollar off. Uh, one sixteenth. That's fine by me. We'll get uh, we'll get two packs of those. That's about all I want from Arc. Uh, you know, I don't really know the brand so well. I know they do rods, everything else. You know, and like I always say, tungsten is tungsten. Whatever kind of manufacturer brand you want to put on there, go for it. Uh, let's see. We got the new Berkeley slobber knocker here. 30% off. Um, I'm going to check out their tubes. I think I'm going to buy a tube. Let's see. Uh, there's Lucky Penny, Green Pumpkin, Gobi. Alright. Um, let's go here. And I'm tempted on Green Pumpkin. All right, there we go. All right, I'm spending my money so that you guys don't have to. So, 575 into the old cart. Let's see. Um, Berkeley Flatworm, where are you, right? Uh, Berkeley Max up the general. Okay. Um, we'll go with three packs of the five inch. And I think that's it. I don't really care for Taco Warehouse's color selection of the Berkeley General, but you know, I picked up a few of these this year. I don't like this little thing, but whatever. It says it's in stock, so we'll get her. All right, so we got three packs of those. Wait, did that not add to my cart? I didn't add to my cart. Damn, I want that. We're getting three of those. Add. Thank you. Wait, now I have ten. What's going on here? Six. All right. Hold on. Hold on. Is there a way to minus this? You know what? Actually, oh, exit this. Let's get three more now. We'll play this game. All right. There we go. Uh, Berkeley Flatworm, where are you? Did I pass it? Uh, they sold it at Flatworms? Ah, oh, there we go. So, uh, if you are, uh, let's say you live in Ontario, um, and you can get there, uh, Ganyan Sports actually has a better deal on this stuff. Uh... I'm trying, uh, they actually have it uh, a fair bit cheaper than even Tackle Warehouse is 30% off, but um, it's $20 to ship to my house. I, there's no way I'm going to drive to Oshawa. I don't think I've ever driven to Oshawa, so I'm not going to start now. 
I was trying to think of how much money I save here. So seven nineteen. I think you save forty or fifty cents by buying a thirty pack, which is kind of stupid. I mean, God forbid you knock it down like two dollars. They do the same crap with their uh, Berkeley General. There we go, Mark. Uh, keeping it real here. All right, I want mango. I'm just trying a bunch of weird stuff to be honest with you. I, I do like the four and a quarter, I guess. Uh, green pumpkin's already on sale. So let's, uh, bam, three. All right, so we got smelt, natural shad. I've been wrecking house with natural shad this year. I, I like it a lot better than black shiner. I don't have a lot of, uh, a lot of experience with the Berkeley flatworm. Uh, I think that will do. What is that? How many is that? 11? Damn, that's going to be expensive. Alright. <laughs> Alright, let's keep on. Uh, one more thing here. The Berkeley Creature Hog. Uh, Max N Creature Hog. So I've been using this as a jig trailer and it's been working quite well. So let's get one of those. And I have actually been, I picked up the South African color. And it's been working pretty good. I don't think I'm going to buy it again, but that's not a bad looking color. Alright, two of those. Alright, let's get out Berkeley. I think I'm broke there. Uh, let's go to G-Crack, because you know what, we'll do that at the end. I can't afford to buy G-Crack. Oh, dropped my pop bottle over. Can't afford to, uh, oh, that's going to go flat for sure. Shoot. Can't afford to buy G-Crack normal price. Uh, Guggen Squad, uh, I've never tried any of their crap, but you know what? Let's get a Lunker Log. Uh, my thought process with, with uh, this was, originally I thought it was like the Guggens that made their stuff, and it's nothing against them, uh, except like none of them fish anymore. And I was like, do I really want a bunch of people that no longer fish to make stuff? And I was like, probably not. Uh, but now I think they usually get other professional fishermen to design their stuff, so let's give it a go. Uh, maybe that one. Sprayed now, not digging that. Uh, what do we got here? Alright, let's grab, I'm going to grab this in the 4 inch. There we go, $3.37. I think that's all I need from, I'm not sure what they make. Uh, that's rods, missile baits. We're gonna be very quick here on this guy. Um, we like, see, and this is why I wanna, I wanna touch base a little bit on this. John Cruz does it right. So a six pack is 422 or 25 pack is 14.39 so four times six 24 and that's about 17 dollars so i mean that's all i'm asking for is two or three dollars less to buy bulk um uh where's super bug where are you right here this is uh that's money all right that's all i want from missile now we go to mustad uh, so I love these hooks here. Uh, these are my drop shot or my wacky worm hooks. Uh, they started charging the red ones more. So we're going to, I think I have a fair bit as I increase the numbers here. So we're going to grab four of each, uh, one aught and two aught. Uh, three aught is not even suitable for a six inch worm. If you're going to throw the three aught, then you better have at least a seven inch uh, Sanko. All right, I am spending a lot of money here. I actually, I thought I was going to go pretty low key here. But uh, I don't know how this is working out for me. All right, uh, where's our jackhammer? All right. Green pumpkin shad, maybe? Sure. That's you know what? I got sending the the vibes to that one. 
Alright, how much is that after tax? Uh, $11.51, sorry, before tax. Um, that's about all I wanted from Z-Man. They've got some sale products that we'll hit up in the clearance section first or after. Alright, so uh, that's pretty much it for the brands. We're going to go to uh, AccuCall. AccuCall. AC. Right over here. Oh, man. Uh, sorry, it's CalCoast. I'm trying to get uh, calling uh, things here. CalCoast. Alright, so these are the ones that Lionel use. Uh, I like them. They're alright. So we're going to get one 20% off. Damn. We're spending a lot more money than I'd, I had uh, I had hoped to. Uh, next, we are getting um, a boat buckle. So we have two options here. We have a boat buckle and then like a rod tie down. I'm going to get the rod tie down. Uh, and I'm just going to get one now that I've got the new boat here. Uh, I guess black is probably, maybe gray, I don't know. Do I want to pop? I don't know. You know what? I don't know what I want to pop here. What's that one I like? But yeah, these seem pretty simple. So you just huck them onto here and away you go. There's no, ah, oh man. There's no reviews with them, so. We're gonna go silver. They're about... Ten dollars cheaper than the boat buckle one, so we'll try one. If we like it, we'll get another one. All right. Uh, I think that was more or less it, minus the clearance section, which is just really a free for all. I just wanted to see if they did the. Oh man, the tactical wake is so expensive. I wanted to get, one, but that's just not gonna happen. At twenty percent off, seventy-five bucks. Has any reviews? Works great while it does. <laughs> Mine split on the front segment and now epoxied it back together twice because I want to keep using it. Maybe just got a lemon. Yeah, they should hold up more for 75 bucks. Uh, yes, we're going to grab some of these because they're $10. Good lord. $10 down from 28 This is what I'm talking about. 20% off that? Damn. Let's go hog wild here. How big are these things? Seven and a half inches. Damn. This is pretty sweet. Alright. I normally get Huddleston's, but I think I'm going to get like three of these and call it a day. Eight dollars. I know they've got the actions almost non-existent. I accidentally got this bait. Nah, nah, nah. Some people love it. Some people hate it. I don't know. You know, for that little of money, you know, we can take that gamble. Uh, so that was largely it. Let's stick to the clearance section here before I spend more money that I do not need to. Uh, oh, you know what? This is actually a rarity, so we're going to go back to the main screen here. We're going to grab two of these that are on sale for... Uh, they're 25% off, and I assume I get an extra 20% off the Fish Hammer brand. I picked up a few of their jigs uh, on the cheap last... Uh, Last Black Friday, I believe, or, or a while ago. I always meant to throw them, and you know how it is. I never got around to throw them. So we'll pick up a couple of these little micro jigs. Uh, no, I want to go, go small. All right. Did I get the sale? I did. Three ninety. So I'm getting two finesse jigs for $3.90. Not too bad. All right, but we really do have to, like, stick to... Um, stick to some kind of pretense that we're keeping our budgeting in line here. Alright, what else we got here? Uh, so there's going to be a lot of cool stuff here that I'm going to grab one or two and... Yumdinger ball packs are on sale? Okay. Uh, Gilly. Alright. So, I think... I'm going to pick up three packs, and I'm going to give them to my brother-in-law for Christmas. Or his birthday or something? I don't know. Whatever. Like, there's 90 yumdingers. Go nuts. Uh, and yum, you know, there's nothing against yumdingers. They don't really uh, sink too much. They're a very light uh, buoyancy worm. Um, but they work. I use them all. You know, I don't use them all the time, but I do use them. And a lot of times, 
Um, if I have someone in the boat with me and I'm like, hey, I don't want you to use $10, uh, $10 Sankos, here you go. Oh, damn, forgot. All right, you know, let's finish off this. I forgot Strike King. So make a memo note that we got to go back to the Strike King. Uh, where did I see it? All right, right here. The Tackle HD Nedmite. Uh, 25 packs. These things look pretty cool. I'm just trying to think of what color I want. I'm leaning towards the green pumpkin, which I really like that green pumpkin. Let's just see what else we got here. Chartreuse. Green pumpkin goby. Eh, I don't really like the flake. Eh. It's watermelon red. That's not bad. I like the red flake. All right, we're going to go with green pumpkin. Alright, so I got 25 of those Ned Rig up. Uh, Spro. Uh, no, not gonna do it, Spro. Maybe. Stickworm. <sighs> Alright, you know what? Just for the sake, because I'll know I'll make a video on this at some point. Like, what's a. Ooh, what's a Spro, whatever this crap is? Or their stickworm? What's that like? Alright, Waterman Red Flake. No, Ozark Craw. Five inch. It's a four pack? Okay, this must be Dura Attack, right? Uh. High quality Japanese plastic? Oh, don't give me that crap. You can put more than four in a pack in here. No wonder why your stuff's on clearance. Sorry, I'm so cynical. Uh, let's see, I have clear. That's not a bad little color. And Ozark Craw. I'm going to do Ozark Craw. And we're going to do the five inch, obviously. I want to get bit here. All right, so three dollars and fifty-eight cents. Still, I mean, holy moly, it's like a dollar worm. Uh, you know, I'll probably do a review on their yam stick from G Crack here. Um, green pumpkin, sure. Oh, four point eight and the five point eight. All right, damn, we're already at three hundred bucks U.S. Adds up when you're having fun, I guess. Um. You can get cheaper. They only have their crushed goby on sale. I wouldn't buy, buy it from there. Um, that's pretty cool. What else? Alright, I know I want this guy. Because he's all, just for the sake of it being half off. <laughs> it's like, alright. Uh, one... Two, three, I think. Let's get a bigger picture. Oh, I don't like that red flake. All right, we'll get this guy. All right. So they went down 438. That's not right, because they're five something, right? They're 547, so 20% off that dollar. Yeah, that is right. Never mind. Uh, not a whole lot left here. Bunch of buzz budget baits here. Not no real interest in them. Uh. Okay, these ones are pretty cool. I actually used these. I picked them up pretty cheap like this last year. Um, and they work quite well. Grab one, one. There we go. I guess I can justify $30 of that is, uh, or 20 bucks of that is a, a birthday gift. They're a good deal in these little, like, kits. Okay, Z-Man Pro Cross. Not the Pro Cross. I wanted to try their Hella Cross. There we go. They're 37% off plus my 20% off. So that's pretty good. Uh, I'm very like picky with their colors. I like the deal. And I like Canacraw, which they don't have. So we're going to grab two in the deal. And where are they? Are they packs of two? Or you get three. All right. That's fine. Uh, the Pro Craw was okay, but I, I felt like it was too bulky for my needs. All right. Let's go back to brand. Striking. They might actually have new brands or new colors of Ocho's, anyways. 
Strike King Worms. Here we go. Nope. There we go. Alright. My worm of choice here. We're going to grab. Let's grab four of those, I think. No, let's grab five. I don't see any new colors here. I've still got a, a whack. This is just one of the things that I don't want to run out of. So 367 a pack. So we're a fair bit over budget, but I don't think we're like crazy, crazy over budget. Uh, let's go back to clearance. Let's snag a few hooks, and then I think I think it was a swim bait that did me in. To be honest with you, let's see. Oh damn, I need umbrella rigs. Ah, that's another forty bucks US. Let's struggle. All right. Um, let's take a look at these little jig heads here. Quarter. All right, I think. What do you, what are they in a pack here? One eight. They're all three pack. Okay. So let's grab. They seem pretty cheap. Let's grab four. Three bucks a pack. All right, little swim bait heads for the uh, umbrella rigs that I have to go purchase. This be way more money. I was gonna get another thing of uh, of trapper hooks because they're so inexpensive, and uh, I actually really like them. So so. Let's see, I got 20 hooks for 5 bucks or 25 hooks for 5 bucks. So let's grab one of those and a 5 eye. Yeah. Okay. Uh, if you ever get a chance on YouTube, there's a little video about uh, the guy that did the trapper hooks and how he like lost his company. So I always like wondered what, what went on with trapper hooks. And uh, because they won all these iCast awards. And then all of a sudden it's like... Um, you never hear from them, and now they're like six cents <laughs> on the dollar, and they're like stupidly cheap. And uh, it turns out that it was just like infighting from the partners. All right, so let's grab a couple of these. I don't like them as well as the Z-Man heads, but for the price, I mean, you're not going to beat those. So we're going to get, say, two in the number one, one sixteenth ounce, and two. All right, we're massively, massively over, under budget, over budget. Yes, God, I wish we were under budget. Wouldn't that be something? Umbrella rig. That's I uh, usually I think Picasso is um, got a deal going on. Uh, uh, usually they're part of the thirty percent off, I believe, uh, but not this time. So. Can I sort by price? Yeah, let's go lowest price. Uh, there, I've been looking at a couple. They're kind of just a, a grab bag as far as like people's opinions on it. I want something with, that has blades. I've heard bad things about the Six Sense one, but they're just not one of these lures that everyone is is talking about. Uh, I need to grab two. And the reason why is because I know one's going to get snagged up and lost, like, instantly, so. I th think. Uh, pretty good. One's to usually attach one eighth to one quarter. Yeah, okay. So, that's legal in Canada. So, let's, I just want to get a breakdown of the sizing here. The original is nine inch. The junior is seven and a half. Uh, I think seven and a half should be sufficing. Nine inch. Let's go two. All right, which is legal in Canada. We'll double check that later. All right, so let's take a look here at our cart, and I think that's it for us. Uh, let's see. So let's recap. We got 72 items for $400 US. 
a uh, couple tungstens, like two dollars and eighty six cents for tungsten is pretty cheap. A couple Berkeley uh, tubes here. Uh, the general max scent pitcher's not coming in. A bunch of flatworms, you know. Obviously, they're getting talked to uh, death here, but that's because they work. Let's see, a couple creature hogs. Uh, one Guggen Lunker Log, Missile D Bomb. Big pack here, some wacky worm hooks. Uh, one jackhammer for 11 bucks. I mean, why would you really, like, say what you want? I mean, but I mean, the jackhammer is the pinnacle. I mean, why would you throw anything else at $11 for a chatterbait? I mean, that's good luck beating that. Uh, call tags. I guess the call tags and the rod tie downs don't really count as, like, purchases in the sense of. Uh, let's, let's watch Mark uh, justify his purchases here. But, I mean, I, I'll need them for the boat, so, I mean. Uh, these I did not need, but we got them for 8 bucks a pop, so. Uh, a few uh, finesse jigs here. Some bulk packs, again, there's like 22 bucks that we didn't need. Uh, some Norries flip gills here, so I'm pretty excited to try these. Uh, I know the Trailblazers work pretty well. Uh, let's just do this. I got three packs, so it's 12. You know what? Yeah, that's more than enough. More than enough. Because I'll, uh, I'll run out of jig heads. I'll run out of umbrella rigs before I run out of jig heads, so we're good there. Uh, trapper hooks, uh, the mustad grip pin, the Ned rig heads, they work well. And some umbrella rigs. There we go. Uh, yeah. So shipping's not going to be free, unfortunately, but I mean, you do get, you know, promo stuff here to mitigate your shipping costs. Anyways, guys, that's my video. So thank you guys for watching. We are $98.33 over budget. Uh, maybe 60. I can probably, I can probably talk myself into saying $70 of that is, uh, was necessities and not purchases in a sense so really i guess i'm only like 30 dollars over budget which ain't bad uh, i do plan on going hog wild for their 25 days of christmas if uh if they have a good sale oh man i forgot one more thing one more thing here which is gonna this is the the deal here i guess i've always wanted to try these oh what's that damn all right hold on everyone stop uh, yellow magic is it yes all right the yellow magic poppers apparently are like the deal look at all these reviews <laughs> all right let's grab one uh eeny meeny i'm thinking bone maybe yellow frog does that what's the bottom look like mm. what's the difference uh Three and a half. We're gonna grab the three and a half for sure. All right. Uh, apparently, these are almost identical to the Mega Bass uh, poppers, except they're cheaper. But I don't know. But I got on such a crazy popper bite that uh, we're getting a a popper. So there we go, guys. That's the real end. We're uh, four hundred eleven dollars and ninety two cents. Let's put this on the old credit card before I change my mind. Thank you guys for watching and take care.